Daily Devotion with Pastor Bala for September 17th, 2023, from Revelation chapter 8, verse 10. The third angel blew his trumpet, and a great star fell from heaven, blazing like a torch, and it fell on a third of the rivers and on the springs of water. A great meteor, for a star would actually completely wipe out the earth. But this meteor would only destroy one third of the waters. Again, it's where people are still able to survive because only one third of the waters would be undrinkable. Verse 11. The name of the star is Wormwood. A third of the waters became Wormwood. And many people died because, verse 11, the name of the star is Wormwood. A third of the waters became Wormwood. And many people died from the water because it had been made bitter. The name Wormwood is a bitter poison. We currently live in a world where many of our fresh water supplies are undrinkable. And it seems that many people struggle with bitterness also in today's world. Notice also that the Bible describes Jesus as the living water. And that faith brings about the joy of salvation, which undoes the bitterness. Verse 12. The fourth angel blew his trumpet, and a third of the sun was struck, and a third of the moon, and a third of the stars, so that a third of their light might be darkened, and a third of the day might be kept from shining, likewise a third of the night. Again, this is a vision as a third of the natural light is darkened. Keep in mind that Jesus also is described as the light of the world. So if you're getting an idea that some of these trumpets and with the plague, so to speak, is the exact opposite of who Jesus is, I think you're on the right path. Verse 13, Then I looked, And I heard an eagle crying with a loud voice as it flew directly overhead. Woe, woe, woe to those who dwell on the earth at the blasts of the other trumpets that the three angels are about to blow. This is a vision. Remember, eagles don't typically speak. Balaam's donkey did speak, but that was at God's directive to warn Balaam. Now the eagle speaks to prepare the people for the next three blasts of the trumpet. They are going to be a doozy of a blast, but that'll be in chapter 9. God's peace and many blessings be with you, and thank you for listening. And please take an opportunity to share this message with others. If you have enjoyed these daily devotions, please consider making a donation to Peace Lutheran Church. 24024 West Main Street, Plainfield, Illinois, 60544. Thank you again for listening.